Alright, I'm back with more requests, and we're going to be doing Ghost Helper 2 by LB. He says it's easier than his last map. I don't believe you for a second. And if we get done with that quickly, we will go on to Walk the Line by Knock. Let's get started. Oh, okay. Let's see what we got here. So that goes over there. I guess I have to break the line. Or something. Oh, these separately drop. Okay, they don't, they're not together. That's good. What did this do exactly? Oh, it turns that on. Duh, should have noticed that. So now if I break one of these connections... Gotta find out what that does. Oh, part of that and then the other one... No, it's not part of that. Or is it? Let's find out. Instead of just asking that, let's find out. No, it's not. Alright, so this one definitely does something. So if I go back... Oh, I can shut this off. How long is that? Oh, that turns that on. Oh, I thought it was going to shut the fizzer off. Nope, never mind. So I could take this and put it over, but then I have no way of getting over there to put it into the, uh, the blocker, or to block it. So we'll do this side, which is probably the same concept, because then that's part of that, but I also need a cube for the end. Which might be that one. Okay. Alright, so if I take this one. Oh, there actually isn't a fling thing. If that makes any sense. Uh, to put that in there. It might be that one. How do I get that in there, though? Unless this goes into that. In which case, oh, I have to shut it off with that as well. I'm pretty sure this is for that one. If my memory serves me right. But that'll just kill me. And I don't want that. So let me go back over. Maybe if I put it in the other... ...thing... ...I'll get some assistance. Oh yeah, they are part of the same light bridge. Alright, just, just double check in there. So I guess it really didn't help me at all. <laughs> if only you could turn on. That would be great. Just like that. And if only I could turn you on... Well, I guess I could kill this one. And get it back. Because I did fling it over there in the first place. Unless I have to do it the opposite way for that side. Nope, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> Get back here. So maybe put this one... ...over in there. And do this one as well. No, I need this one. In here. Right, because I have to put this in here, and then something. Probably getting this wrong. Well, that's interesting. Does that work every time I do that? It does. I was just trying to figure out which cube was which, but I think I found out something here. <laughs> I got a little confused. So it does stay on. It does stay on the, uh, well, it blocks the laser for a little bit. So I could actually press that and run over. And 
get this over here as well. There we go. Interesting concept. Very interesting. I don't think I've ever played a map with that before. Or at least based around that idea. At least I'm hoping that's what this is based around. Isn't that just going to kill me, though? <laughs> right? Unless I press this and it does... And it goes over there. Like if I, Let's see if that works. Yes. Alright. I'm liking this. I'm liking this a lot. still amazes me how they're all this time I'm still learning new things about this game. Alright, so what did that do? Let me just check what color that is. Color. That's a, that's a shape, not a color. It's the shape of a square. That was part of that. Alright, so then the other X was over there, I remember. So if I take this off... Shit. Oh wait, no, never mind. What am I talking about? Do this. Get this over here. Oh, almost got it actually. Set that there. Let's see what happens with this. Not kill ourselves on there. So, would I just grab this cube and drag it through? Yes, yes, I would. That was an awesome map. I love that. I can always look for LB to make maps with interesting little concepts I've never really even thought of using before. So thank you for that. Let's go on the Nox map. We have Walk the Line. My guess is walking along the edges of the light bridge, the very the, like the angle of it, but I'm probably wrong completely. So let's let's see how wrong I am. Laser cube? Not regular cube. Oh, we're blocking lasers again. Good thing I just did a map exactly like that, so I have somewhat of an idea to do. Do this, let's see. I lied, I have no idea what I'm doing. Why do I have it on this side? What do I need that for? Is it to walk through? But see, it wouldn't land there. If it was landing there, it would just swap over. I'm, I'm guessing I have to come back for that, which is why I didn't want to walk through. Maybe I have to do other parts first before I get over here, so we need three cubes to leave. Got our laser cube over here, which you can take back. That might take me... Or a frank cube. That might take me really far back. Puts that down. You, though. Your square connection. Where is there a square connection at? Oh, right there. Oh, that's a cool little hole. I don't think I've ever seen that used like that before. Should I portal that? Why not, just in case. What do you do? Oh, I want to take this with me. I feel like I might need it. Nope, we don't need you. But we're going to kill you anyways. Does this just loop me back around to the beginning? Yes, it does. Okay. Alright, so I'm, I'm guessing it's going to fall into the same line of what we just did. Not as hardcore, though, but similar idea. Shutting that off allows me to get the cubes in. But I have no way of actually portaling anything. So I can get the, the laser off. I don't see a way how to. This just lets me walk right in. Where do you take me? Take me right there. There's got to be some sort of uh, some sort of way to do this that I'm not seeing. I mean, obviously, but you know, you know what I'm talking about. Is 
So why do I need this down? You know, getting one of those would be really useful. I'd love to do that. There's got to be some trick with that first cube. To be able to portal into here somewhere, or something like that. I could just set this here. Oh. I could just set that there and grab it through. That would make a lot more sense. <laughs> Why didn't I think of that earlier? Because, yeah, then I can do that concept that we just learned, thankfully. I probably wouldn't have figured that out here as easily as I did in the other one. Which one shuts off the uh, fizzler? Is it this one? It's this one. So, if I can swap these out, that would probably be way more useful. But I feel like if I put this... I don't have to put it... I was going to put it on the faith plate. I don't have to. But... Oh, I actually hit something from over there. Huh. Okay, we'll have to go check that out in a second. So you go over there. So I can always re-grab the other cube. Let's go through here. Let's take this one with us. Since I can get both. I'm just, I'm just missing that. Okay, I gotta go and fix that. It's just hard to see from that far away. I gotta listen to it a little better. That's on there now. It should be. Yes, and that did. Oh, wait, and then I just put this on the button that lowers that, and then I can portal there and there and get that. Please hit that. Oh my god, I hate you. Can I lift it up? No, now I gotta go back and try to hit, hit both. Actually, do I have to hit both? I think I only have to hit one. Oh no, I need both because that flips that. Oh, that's gonna be annoying if I take that off there. Alright, let's give it a try. Oh, I can't go through that because... Well, actually, that no, doesn't matter. We'll just try to line it up a bit better. Maybe to, like, right there. A little more to the left, I think it was, in the last time. So it should have a better chance of lining up. Yeah, that seems way more centered to me. There we go. So now I can go over and grab the Franken cube. And I should have all three to leave, right? Oh, I just have to kill that cube. I have to kill it, but I also have to be able to get in here at the same time. I was not thinking of that. How would I do that, then? I'm trying to work it out in my head real quick. Probably simpler than it seems. It just comes with the problem that I can't make it through. I could go around, kill it, and it's over there. Just when I thought I had it figured out. But what if I bring the uh, the regular cube back that was in the original room to start with, and I do somewhat of a similar concept uh, that I did earlier, with pressing the button and walking through? Yeah, I can get that. Right. I'm a little worried there. All right, give me you. Come down here. I want you off. Never mind. I was making it way harder than I thought it was. <laughs> See, I told you. All I had to do was bring it back. Just bring these both through. I was just testing you. I knew what to do all along. I was just seeing if you caught what I was doing wrong. 
Yeah, I'm sticking with that story. That's what we'll do. Well, hey. At least we got it over here. Might not have been the way I wanted it, but we got it over here. There we go. Again, another really nice map. Both of you made really nice maps this episode, so thank you for sending them to me. I'm going to give it a thumbs up. And I think next episode will be Body Sheila. That's the name. I completely forgot what it was for a split second. I was going to say Subject X, but that's wrong. But yeah, Body Sheila is next.